Hey folks, Mike Foss here, past owner and guide to Northern Wisconsin Outfitters, and most of you know that I'm an outdoor writer for On Wisconsin Outdoors. Today, we're up in Northern Wisconsin, and we're gonna feature the Quiet Cat Bike. Hey, one of the features that I really like about this, this uh, Quiet Cat Bike is some might call them saddlebags, um, but it's actually called a, a Panera bag. But they're all waterproof to carry your gear in. And you put your clothing in there or, or gear, you, you roll it up, waterproof, and there's actually a, a shoulder strap that you can connect on here and uh, carry it around out on your venture out in the woods. Another great accessory is this pull behind cart. As you can see, I have my tree stand and ladder sticks, but there's so many other things that you can put in here. Your turkey decoys, even a blind will, will fit in here. Just strap it in and take off. And of course, the main feature of the Quiet Cat bike is the battery powered electric assist. With five settings to choose from, you decide which one to choose as you pedal on your next adventure. Well folks, I hope you enjoyed our video today. We had a lot of fun making it. For more information on the Quiet Cat bike, go visit quietcat.com. And remember to follow me all season long on On Wisconsin Outdoors as I shared my adventures with the Quiet Cat. Did I say again, Pete? Well, folks, <laughs> we're gonna feature Quiet Cat here. Oh, God, uh, why do I forget that? <laughs> I'm an outdoor writer for On Wisconsin Outfitter. <laughs> <laughs> the guys that I let ride this bike. Oh, I'm recording all this. <laughs> it's good, right? As you can see, I have my tree stand and my climbing sticks. Uh, there's nothing. <laughs> There's nothing better. <laughs> oh my god, I started to say um and I, I caught myself and it was um. You know, I make these sweet videos and everyone forgets about the cameraman. I'm doing all the work. And Mike's going to be the hero of the day. He's going to get all the love. Later, no, I'm going to stick this in there at the end.